Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. So in my Wanderer's Journal video, I mentioned that there were only two possibilities for why the Wanderer's Journal would state that the Hive was unmarred by the infection. But I forgot a third option. That I'm an idiot. So in this quick video, I'm going to run through some of the comments I've received on that video and what my thoughts are after reading them. And don't worry, I won't make any Rick and Morty jokes. Instead, I'll make Archer jokes. A lot of people theorize that the Hive wasn't infected when Elena came to Hallonest, since she might have arrived before the night. So I completely forgot to mention that this book is being written during the events of Hollow Knight. Elena sees Shio's painting of the night in Greenpath. Not sure how the fuck she got there, but whatever. She sees bread in both the fungal wastes and in Dirtmouth. And she visits the Ancient Basin both before and after the door to the Abyss is opened. And on top of that, she mentions that Vespa is in fact dead by the time she gets to the Hive. So that's definitely not what's happening. Now I want to talk about another popular theory I saw that I actually think makes a lot of sense. And it all has to do with phrasing. So Elena uses the word unmarred, but what the fuck does that word even mean? Well it means not marred or injured. So what if Elena is actually saying that the Hive is infected, just not injured by it? Now I know what some of you are thinking. What makes bees so fucking special that the infection doesn't hurt them? Well, I'll give you a hint. Ants. These types of bugs naturally operate under a hive mind. So when the radiance rolled in with her insidious Fanta formula, the bees didn't even fight it. That's why the whispering root says, light familiar. They are already familiar with being under a hive mind. So they continue to just be bees doing the things that bees do. Ergo, when Elena shows up, nothing seems out of the ordinary. Ergo, ergo, unmarred by the spread of the infection. One final note, some people mention that the hive blood charm proves the bees aren't infected because bees don't attack the knight when the hive blood charm is equipped, but I think this is just because the bees don't recognize the knight as a threat anymore. They have been tricked into thinking the knight is one of them. I'm not sure why the hive husk doesn't attack the knight either, but it's obvious that this thing is infected. Either that or it's wearing colored contact lenses. Also, some people have said that the gas that the bees give off is pollen, which I highly doubt, but I guess I can't really argue against it. Now that I think about it, how the fuck do the bees even make the honey in the first place? The hive is closed off. They should have all starved to death long ago. And I think that about wraps things up. I also got a lot of comments about how the king's past lore tablets might have been created for the vessels. That's entirely possible, but I think it's weird that the third one seems to have been written when Hallonest was still standing, but I think I'll save that for another video. Well anyways, thanks for watching. Archer